Yes. I am so excited that we're going to be taking a trip to New York City for a month. Well, I'm glad that you're excited for our trip, but I want to remind you to behave during your trip. If you misbehave, then they're grounded. That also means that you need to behave during the car ride, especially because it's going to be a 12-hour drive to New York City. What? You can't be serious. 12 hours is just too... Oh, that's too bad. If you misbehave during the car ride, then you'll be grounded as soon as we arrive to New York City. Are you there yet? No, we are not. We told you at home, Frozen, that we are not even close, and stop asking us that, or you will be grounded. This is your final warning. If you ask us if we are really dead one more time, then we will be grounded when we arrive to New York City. Are we there? Yes, that does it. As soon as we arrive in New York City, you will be grounded at least a few days during our trip. That means that you will not get to do certain fun activities, such as going to the Empire State Building during your grounding time, and you'll also have your phone taken away too. No, please don't ground me. I don't want to be grounded. That's just too bad. We should have thought of it before you disobeyed us when we told you to stop asking us if we are really in. Anyway, we need to stop and get petrol soon, so I'll probably be stopping at the next fuel station. I will fill up the car with petrol. Three minutes later. All right. Now that I've finished in filling the car with gas, I'm going to go inside the fuel station and use the restroom. Okay. I think I'll also go use the restroom. Actually, I feel like using the bathroom too. Phew. I can't believe that I'm all the... Are you going to be grounded for the first few days of this trip? I don't think I will enjoy this fucking trip if I keep getting grounded by my parents during this vacation. Then, I really wish that I could just go on this trip without my parents. So they can ground me during this trip. Wait a minute. That gives me an idea. I can drive the car down to the hotel in New York City by myself and abandon my parents at this fuel station. My dad left the car seat on the front seat while my parents are using the restroom inside the fuel station. I'll get into the front seat of the car and drive the car away. All right. I will now turn the car on. Wait a second. It's lit down. Yes. This is so exciting. I am looking forward to going on the trip to New York City without my parents constantly grounding me. I think that I will. Oh, fuck. It's the police. I need you to step out of this car right now. I... you because the vehicle that you are driving has been reported as stolen. We just got a report about 20 minutes ago that the owners of this car had their car stolen by their daughter. Is this true? Well, I, um, 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 okay, fine. I will tell you what happened. My parents and I went on a road trip to New York City for our vacation. But during the road trip, my parents grounded me for at least a few days during our trip. Because I kept asking them if we were there yet, I was so sick and tired of being grounded by my parents. So when we stopped for petrol, I decided to abandon my parents at the fuel station. So that I could go to the hotel in New York City by myself and not constantly be getting grounded by my parents. Well, that sounds like a bullshit reason to steal your parents' car. Stealing a car is a very serious crime. And your parents can have you arrested for this if they want. No, 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 no. Please don't arrest me for this. I'm sorry. Well, I'm going to talk to your parents about this incident. 
and they can decide whatever or not if they want to have you arrested. Anyway. I just found out that the state police have found the adult who was driving your car. They stopped her about 20 kilometers away from here. Right now, they are stopped on the highway, and the state police wants to know whatever or not you want to press charges against her. I was thinking it right now. You all can get into my police car, and I'll drive you to where your daughter and your car. And decide how you want to deal with this situation. All right, then. Because I just wanted to enjoy the trip and near it without you get grounded constantly. That is no excuse for what you did. You get grounded constantly because you are constantly misbehaving and deserve to be grounded when you misbehave. And you're definitely going to be grounded for what you just did. So, would you like to press charges against your daughter for stealing your car? Well, I definitely think that there is too much of her to be punished for what she did. Although I'm not sure if we want her to be arrested. She does already have a pending felony charge against her for destruction of property. We will already have to spend hundreds, if not thousands of dollars, for her lawyer's own charges. And I don't think we want to deal with her as an old space and even more charges. We will just grant her for what she did. Well, okay then. Well, I guess we will leave now. I hope you drive safely, and I hope your daughter learns a lesson about her behavior. Goodbye. 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 Erasina Oates, get in the car right now. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 o